Hey guys, welcome back to the Gungeon. In this episode, we're going sewer diving. So let's do it. Oh yeah. Pretty solid first floor. Not the best weapons, but we were able to get to the sewer and flawless the first boss. So that's pretty good. I call that a win. A big fat hairy win right on your face. Who doesn't love a fat hairy win on their face? I wake up in the morning, I'm like, yeah, give me that fat hairy win right on my face. Right all over it. All over my face. Thank you. Thank you. W-I-N. <laughs> I just had to vibrate. Oh, table tech sight! Boom! 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 Okay. It's not booming as much as I'd hoped it to boom. We still got him. Why is my shotgun only shooting one bullet? There, it's shooting five. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. Okay. Mushroom man, mushroom man. Better not hit me with that bullet thing. Taste the water. Taste the water. You don't like the water? You don't like the H2O in the sewer? Use of that poopy, poopy, poopy switch? Too bad. Get fresh. Alright, we got a blank. Pretty good. We might need it. I also, what do I have for, oh, I shouldn't do that in the middle of this. I can probably bait these guys into stepping on these holes for me. Although, I might accidentally fall in, so I'm not gonna deal with it if I don't have to. As you can see, they open up. Nice. Thank you, little grenade guy. Oh, there's one more. Boom. Oh, I forget these guys shoot like super fast, so I gotta be careful of those. It's always weird getting out of the sewer and going to floor two, because it's a lot easier than the sewer. So you go from something super easy to something pretty hard, and then you go back to something pretty easy. I'm trying to use my sawed off up here because it won't be that useful once I get to the next floor. I'd rather have that carbine or whatever I have. I don't remember what I got. I have something better. I'm just quickly roll by this. Die ghost. Nice. Alright, so we got the shop. He should have a key for us. And hopefully a good gun. Hark Dog just texted me. It said, Yeah, brah! I don't remember what I said to him. I think I said, oh, I'm staying at your mom's house tonight. And he's like, yeah, bro, do it, do it. And I'm like, all right, fine, mommy too, whatever. You know? She's a respectable lady. She can make her own decisions. And I don't have a place to sleep because I'm going to be homeless. I'm just kidding. Homeless the problem of homelessity in America is bad. Look at that little guy. I'm going to punt him in a second. Alright, so now we're going to bust out the Void Core Assault Rifle. I'm going to leave that guy live for now. One guy left. Save some ammo. And you guys ready for this? Give him the boot! Yeah, the rolling boot. Table tech, baby! I love that because I get free ammo. And by free ammo, it only takes one even though it shoots out three. Which is super nice. I could use some ammo though. Did he have ammo at the shop? No, I don't remember. Oh, I don't know about this situation here. Did I get myself in? I'm gonna let these guys get poisoned, hopefully. Oh, no, 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 no. I rolled, and I knew I was going to roll into it. Alright. Everybody gets one. But that's it. That's all you get. Die. Alright. So, possibilities, possibilities. We can go down, or left. Oh, this is something, because, see this light here? That means that's something different. It's a muncher. We could probably munch some guns at the end. We can munch a sawed off for sure. But let's see where we're at. 
And then that's the crest that I need. I gotta pick that up after I fight the boss. I've tried doing some, like, really janky stuff. I'm gonna flip these tables. And what I mean by that is, I've tried picking up that crest, like, and then picking up a whole bunch of armor, and it still puts... I thought I was gonna die there. It still pushes the crest into the last spot. So that stinks. Yeah, I thought I was gonna roll into that. I was about to roll, and then I saw that sewage up there. And, like, my heart stopped for a quick second. Alright, so there's some hearts there. I like that there's pizza in the garbage and stuff. Okay. Okay. Poopy brown. Don't want to spend a key on it. How many keys you got, Mr. Keeper? Just a one. Just a one key. I need one key for sure for that room. Hmm. Not really too sure. He doesn't have any ammo. I don't know what to do. I really need ammo. I got hose on the first floor. All brown chests so far. We're actually playing decently, but the chests are just killing us. Alright. Whoa, what is this over here? Shooting three bullets. Okay, it's one of these things. Flip it! Flip it real good! Oh, I wanted a two for one special. I got no ammo. Darn it. All right, we're gonna have to munch. I didn't really want to munch this early. Oh, and then I got hit. Shoot! Not a good run so far, as far as items go. Usually I'm a lot more lucky with items. I have been getting to the fifth floor consistently too. Dang, we really need ammo. Okay, if I don't get anything, this floor, or this room, excuse me. I'm gonna have to munch. I don't really want to munch this early, man. I love having the munchies and eating a lot, but... Mm, I don't like throwing away my guns if I don't have to this early. Especially since I got alright room clear guns. Like, they're not bad. They're not the best. Helps out a lot. Okay, just as long as there's tables in these rooms, we are golden. There's the boss. Big old sewery, angry Kirby. I'm like, Kirby, I don't want to fight you, but he wants to fight me every time. Oh, that's probably worth it. That is probably worth it. I'm gonna buy the key. Going back there. Please don't be a mimic. Okay. Come on! <laughs> I don't want a heart. I want a gun, man! I bet they're gonna give me, like, a brown chest here, too. Wouldn't doubt it. Wouldn't put it past them. Wow, I got caught in the door. I was extremely lucky. You can kind of influence where their bullets go. You'll see me do that when I don't have a lot of ammo in a good gun or if I just don't have a good gun. That way it's easier on yourself for the rolls. Yes! Give me that hot key. Ah, oh, it's a poopy brown one! Alright. So, right now we have to open up one of the poopy brown ones and then save the key for the other... So, I guess let's open this one. We're right here. Give me a gun. Yes, that's a good gun. Er, decent. Good enough for the boss. I wonder if I should still munch. I don't think I'm going to munch. I am going to get some armor, I think. Just in case. Actually, I'm good. I'm good. 
I'm good. I don't need armor for this guy. This guy's not too bad. All right, here we go. Mung Bear Pig versus Evil Sewery Gross Kirby. Blah 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 blah. No, I never get to this guy. I forgot he doesn't. Oh yeah, he does get affected by that. Yeah, that's good. Okay, okay, okay. Focus up, Mongo. Focus up. Focus up. Focus up. You got this. The nice thing about this gun is it's got range. It's okay if we get hit on this guy anyways, because he does not give you a master chamber if you beat him flawlessly. Okay, that wasn't bad. And shoot! Gotta get on this corner. Throw that fire down. Serious? I didn't hit him? I figured I was going to get hit there. Probably could have blanked. Should have him either way here. There's hearts all around the map for me too, I believe. So, we should be fine with hearts after we beat this guy. He'll probably give us hearts anyways. There we go. Not too bad. Got hit a couple times like an amateur, but whatever. There he is. Yeah. Eh, eh. Never had this. Blood brooch? What music they make. What does that do? It's cursed, so I might have to drop it. The sinister brooch was once worn by an unlucky inhabitant of the gungeon. Who used it to draw health from wounded enemies. The cost? Okay. Blood brooch. I'm gonna see what this actually does. By using the wiki. Blood. Brooch. It might not be worth it. We might drop it. And then we will lose the curse. I'm going to destroy this guy. Eh. 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 Yeah, <laughs> he takes a while to destroy. So I'm gonna munch. I'm gonna get this chest, and then we're gonna open that as well and grab the old crest. I always stand back a little bit further because it might blow up. Okay, old crest. And so we are gonna munch the sawed off. Sawed off shotgun hand on the pump. And we're gonna also munch the void core assault rifle. Give me something good. Give me something good. Big money, big money, big money, big money. Oh yeah! Samus is gone! Booyah! This is really good. I'll show you guys the Amanamakan real quick. The arm of a famous bounty hunter. Sweet. Love Samus. Love Super Metroid. If you guys haven't watched that playthrough with Eric and I, you really should. It's hilarious. Like, hilarious. Hilarious. Alright, so I think we're done in the sewer here. He doesn't have a key for me, does he? Keys are 25. Armor's 30. I might buy armor. Should I buy armor? For the second floor? Hmm. I need keys. I'm gonna buy armor. I, th I, I think it's worth it. Okay. See how the crest moves over? So that's kind of lame. We will go to the old king if I unlock it. Alright. 
So that was the sewer. I'll see you guys all next time on floor number two. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you want more awesomeness, click on the video and subscribe to my co-op channel. Also, huge thanks to my supporters at Patreon. You guys not only help the channel, but me in so many ways, and I am extremely grateful. And if you want to become a fellow patron, check out the link in the description below. There are some pretty cool rewards, including getting your name in the credits here, and also being able to request a game. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time.